Hey guys, welcome back to another interesting video. As the name suggests, I will read your mind. So let's see how am I doing this. Are you ready? So let's get started. Step number one, you take any two digit number with distinct digits. That means you can take 23, 41, 91 and so on. But you should not take 11, 22, 33 and so on. Have you chosen the number? Now, the second step is you just reverse the number. That means suppose in the step number 1, you have taken the number as 27. Then you take 72 in the step 2. Now, you have two numbers the number which you have chosen and the reverse of that number. Now you just take the bigger number and subtract the smaller number from the bigger number. Now the final step is whatever is your answer you just take the sum of the digits in that number. Have you done all these steps? So it's time to guess the answer. So the answer is 9? Yes. I am sure that the answer is 9. So, how am I able to guess your answer? So, let's see. It is purely mathematical concept. Now, in the step 1, we have taken two digit number, right? And the digits are distinct. That means A is not equal to B, right? Now, in the second step, we have taken the reverse of this number. That means it is B A right and in the third step we are taking the difference but for that let's write this number as now A B it is same as 10 times A plus 1 times B right for example suppose you have a number 23 then you can write this number as 10 times 2 plus 1 times 3 right 20 plus 3 is 23 right and similarly you write this number as 10 times b plus 1 times a right now third step is we just have to take the bigger number and subtract the smaller number from that so for that let's assume that this a is bigger than b so this number is bigger than the number ba right now just take the difference so we have 10 times a plus b 1 times b same as b minus we are taking the difference so it is 10 times b and this becomes minus 1 times a which is a right this is equal to 10 times a minus a is 9 times a and 1b minus 10b is minus 9b right and we can write this as 9 times a minus b right there is a multiplication sign now we have assumed that this a is not equal to b that means this a minus b is not 0 so what are the choices for a minus b now we have taken that a is greater than b right that means a minus b is a positive integer right so it can be either 1 2 and so on up to 9 right that means this is just equal to 9 times 1 9 times 2 9 times 3 and so on up to 9 times 9 right that means this list is just 9 18 and 27 and so on up to 81 right look at these numbers carefully when you take the addition of the digits in that number then it is clearly 9 right for example you can take the number 18 so 1 plus 8 is 9 27 2 plus 7 is 9 and so on 81 8 plus 1 is again 9 i am sure now you have understood that this is not a magic it is clearly a mathematical concept and it is interesting and thank you for watching this video. We will meet again in the next interesting video.